Welcome back to Cabela's A Big Game Pro Hunts. Man, this game's awesome. It's actually hard to stop playing here. Uh, so I got a plan uh, for this uh, video here. We're going to switch it up. We're going to go recurve bow. Uh, so we've been doing a lot of 270. All the episodes have been this 270 here. Uh, but here's this mission here. If we can complete this one, it's hunt two white-tailed deer with a bow. Recurve, 450 grain broadhead. And then we can do a pro hunt up here. Hogzilla Pro Hunt, 6,000 big ones, just needs a recurve bow. So that's the goal. If I can accomplish this, we'll try to do that. We'll just see how the episode goes. I don't know how challenging it is uh, to hunt with the bow. Uh, but let's get this figured out because it's 7,000 for the recurve. So let's buy that. Okay. Now we seem to be loading. Okay, that's good. So no scope, that's fine. And then there's different arrows so 450 is the default and then i guess that's for small game and that's for the big game okay so we got 10 arrows eh all right so that's okay uh that's good you can't do anything there binoculars is fine what can we load here uh can we bring i, I guess we don't really need to bring anything because we're not going to need 20 arrows <laughs> <laughs> I could buy a call. Maybe figure out how that works. I uh, will save money. I don't think you really need to to get a call in this game. Well, so far. All right, so we're going to go to Fox Creek. And we need two white-tailed deer. So it's not very specific. We have five hours to do it. Shouldn't be too bad, as long as it's not really challenging uh, to, to hunt. So, you're trying your hand at bow hunting. Yeah. It's a great tradition. There are some things you need to know. Uh -huh. First, range is limited. A hundred yards is a very long range for a bow. An arrow flies pretty slowly compared to a bullet. Fast moving targets must be led, except at point blank range. The good news is, bow fire is less likely to spook an animal, but it still can. Go ahead and try to hit those targets. Pull the bowstring all the way back before releasing. Keep in mind that the longer you hold your pull, the more tired your arm will get, and less steady your aim. Okay. Makes sense. Sounds like they thought of most things uh, for bow hunting. So where are we in the creek here? Um, yeah, okay, I'm always over here at Buck Hill. This is where the bear, where we're at the bear. And then the hogs are up here. Deer kind of are everywhere. But I haven't hunted down here yet. So, so we got drink time. Okay, so they should definitely be there. Can we get... Okay, wind's good. Alright, let's see here. I'm gonna scoot over there. Okay, so we're at the drink zone. No deer. Hmm. Alright. Normally I just stumble upon deer. But this is a drink zone. Not here. Because uh, it's noon and they definitely should be. Let's go up the creek. And, uh, well, we'll just keep hitting up the water here. They're supposed to be drinking. I don't quite get the need zones in this game. Uh, this is the next need zone. Drink zone. Nothing there. I'm not spooking anything, because it does let you see the noise. So, I'm not too sure. I think if you, uh, splash in the water there, it makes a lot of noise, too. Alright, well, we'll just continue on. Uh, next drink zone. Let's keep going up here, because there's all... All these drink zones are lit up. Okay. Alright, there is definitely... deer at this other drink zone here. Okay. So that's interesting. I, I don't know how it works, but it looks like each herd gets assigned pro two? I'm not, not really too sure. They have multiple anyways. Or maybe they all share and just go to different ones. Either way, not a big deal. Oh, here we go. Oh, we got hogs here too. Oh, okay. So we're gonna lay down. Cause this one's gonna take a bit of patience here. Okay, looks like we could shoot laying down. Oh, okay. So the bow can hit, but it's gray. So I'm just assuming that won't work. Alright, we don't have any cover between us and them. 
There isn't even a stand I can use. There's this one, but it's like right beside them. Oh. Are they still alert? He's kind of looking this way. Okay, good. So let's get back up. And I'm going to crouch in. See if we can get close enough here. Maybe we should have brought the deer call. Invested in that. See how that works. Oh. Okay, so they see me again. So we're going to lay down again. <laughs> can we do the shot from here? Oh, it's, it's got it on target and it's red. I, I'm not going to risk it though. I'm going to wait. I'm going to wait. Okay, we're going to crawl. Oh, don't walk away, guys. Keep drinking. Alright, I forget what the requirements are. It's just two two bucks, right? Or two any deer. Uh, I'm not going to be picky. Just going to try and get this guy that's broadside. The wind can change without warning. Okay. Always make sure you Is this close enough? Position to be downwind from your targets. There. Here we go. Good luck, Arrow. Oh. Oh no, he turned. He turned just the last second. Nice. Okay, that was pretty cool. Whoa, look how far that's going in. Double lung shot. Excellent shot placement. Won't go far. That was cool. That was pretty cool. I like that. Down he goes. Nice. Okay, that was well done. Oh, there's more up there. Okay, because we only need two, right? Okay. So they're all drinking up here. There's one broadside right there. Maybe it's fun to do it like a, a long bow shot. Let's see here. Can we do like a nice long one? Is that fun to do? Oh no, he's turning. Oh, we can do a nice long one too. That could be fun. If we actually land it. Okay, we got some stomping of feet. Wind's good. Okay, this guy's he's broadside there now. We'll slow down time. Right here. Check this out. Go arrow, go. Oh. Shoulder. Doesn't care about the shoulder. Or it does, but. Lung shot. Nice and clean. Nice. Fantastic. That's so cool. Okay. The recurve hunting's pretty cool. Oh, it's even stuck out of him there. I don't expect you'll get another good shot here today. Yep, yeah, okay, 400, okay, 1,200, nice. Double lung, right? So we got lots of money. It's a good sized deer too. And then this guy's gonna be down as well. Nice, okay, that was really cool. I definitely like the bow hunting. That's got a really cool uh, bullet cam effect. I guess arrow cam. That's really fun. Yeah, so uh, people in the comment section have been asking where to get the game. I have no idea. <laughs> Sorry. It's, a, it's not meant to tease people. I, uh, Steam took it down like a while ago, apparently. And if you had it in your library, you can still install it. Oh! Heart shot. Too much hunt. He just spooked. Oh no, too high. Oh well, it doesn't matter. Oh! Sloppy shooting and painful too. Next wow. Time, wait till your target stops and make sure your target. Oh yeah. Let's get him this time. Neom. Oh, it's like the Matrix. Oh. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Alright. 
Uh, let's pick this guy up. He's alright looking, dear. You gotta admit, that camera's pretty cool. Alright, uh, okay, so he's only worth 600. That's fine. Mission accomplished. Now we get to try Hogzilla. This could be fun. Okay, 3000 hunt, uh, two white tail with a bow. Yep, good. Complete. Alright. Trophy collection updated, seven animals added. Okay. So I don't think we need to change anything here. Let's just jump right into Hogzilla. Five hours, recurve bow, that's fine. Starting at noon. Let's just go right into it. I think there's probably a movie. Uh, the game volume for the movie seems to be quiet though, so All right, well we'll see what happens. Today is your lucky day, buddy. Play your cards right. And you're going home with a great story to tell the grandkids. You're about to meet a one-of-a-kind swine, the biggest, nastiest boar you'll ever see. The locals call him Hogzilla. This monster boar is usually milling around in dense cover this time of day. Finding him isn't going to be easy. Hogs have a keen sense of hearing and a nose like a hound dog. You'll need to keep a low profile, watch your step, and stay downwind at all times. You'll make a racket tromping through that brush, so try to move at the same time that boar does. Those giant pig feet will cover the noise of your own footsteps. You'll have to get close to pierce Hogzilla's hide with an arrow. Don't take a shot until the range is under 25 yards. Stay calm, pick a spot, and good luck. Okay, yeah, I think that probably came through pretty quiet in the... Now there's Hogzilla's oh, room. now the volume's better. Second. The wind's at your back right now. You go charging straight in, Hogzilla will be gone before you know it. Make sure the wind's in your favor before you go in after him. Okay, so it already puts you at Hogzilla. Okay. So yeah, uh, I don't know if that is able to hear. Look at That's kind of cool how they set all that up. Um, yeah, I'm not too sure how clear that is on the video. Oh, it's like a little, tiny little map. And, okay was there yeah we got to be in but it was just like an intro to it so and then the the volume corrects as soon as I get in here so how do you hunt this guy if you're restricted to this area with the wind blowing in that direction and they, they want me within 25 yards too so I wonder how this works Um, I, I probably swing around this way because it's got elevation and the wind's kind of going this way, sort of. So you've seen him for yeah, a second. got to get the wind in your favor before he wins you. Yeah, okay, I know. I don't know where he is, though. Oh, there he is right there. to say hogs yes it does okay he's huge all right good it's all right that's exactly where he should be there's just a lot of brush so it's hard to see and i gotta dodge it too there he is okay we gotta get closer though we're gonna keep going this way make sure the wind is in our favor and we're supposed to get closer. Okay, I can start going at him now. What's his range? It says it wants 25 yards. We gotta get way closer. Do I only get one shot of this, do I? Or don't actually know. Oh, was that me or him? Oh, that's him. Okay. Yeah, he's just tromping right through there. Now, he's going with the wind, though, so we're gonna have to go along with him. And I gotta keep dodging these bushes here. Where are you, buddy? I've lost sight of him. Oh. Okay. Thanks for the oink. Oh. 41. Is he alert? 
Oh, this is okay. This has got to be good right here. Look at the tusks on him. Perfect. Oh, he's in the bush. I can't see him. Get out of there. He's going to smell me. Come on. I can't. I don't think I can do anything. He's got to step out of there. Oh my. Okay, I thought he was charging me. I'm going to have to take a shot. I'm going to have a choice. Can we sneak it in there? Or not? Come on. Nope. No! <laughs> okay. So you only get the one shot. Oh, man. Hmm. That's going to take a, a little bit of practice here. Uh, does it play the movie every time? Let's see. Oh, it does. Okay. We're just going to skip it. Okay. That's fine. And it's gonna, yeah, it's gonna do the same thing. Okay, so I'm not gonna record the whole setup on this one because it's pretty much the same thing. I go down uh, the east side and then over. And we'll see how this one goes. Oh, okay. So this time I spooked him. I was just being too aggressive there. Uh, so you can't even spook him either. Man, oh man. Uh, nice and challenging, anyways. Okay, so this time there's these big rocks down the east side. I think you just kind of stay behind them until you get the wind on your side and then go in. So I think that's pretty much going to be the strategy. Because he's over there and you really have to reverse the wind on him. There he is. Okay. I can go right at him this time. Alright, if we get a broadside, should be able to do it here. But I mean, his rib cage is crazy. Oh, okay. So he's alerted. I'm gonna lay down. Oh man! So yeah, it's gonna fail the mission again. That's different. That's this is really challenging. That was my third attempt. So it just gives you this uh, failure thing, and then I'll be in again, <laughs> back in the video uh, when I get him back here. Okay, I'm in the same position I was before. Seems to be how it plays out. We're gonna crawl in this time. And I gotta keep going left to make sure he doesn't... Now, does he see me? That kind of looks like he's alert, right? Okay, heads down. Okay, if he just stays right there and go behind this rock... Oh, no, he's going to journey. Okay. Well, that's okay. As long as the... As long as the wind's okay. Should be fine. I mean, we have our scent eliminator on us, so... This would be really hard without the scent eliminator, I think. It's already pretty challenging. Okay. Head's turn, so we're gonna lay down again. Okay, we're gonna crawl in. I'm hoping that he does, like he'll come back this way. And we just kinda have to stay on this side of him. Pretty tricky. Maybe he just does circles? I'm assuming a shot like this won't work, since they said 25 yards or something. Well, I don't know. Let's give it a go. 
Let's give a 50 yard one. Oh no, he's turning. It's okay, he's coming towards us. Oh, come on, man. Go broadside. Eek. Seriously? Oh, right, right here. This has got to work. I've got nothing but gray. Come on. He's got... All it has is gray. Like, is it hitting the tree? I think it's hitting the tree. Oh, man. <laughs> like, the, the little aim dot was gray. I'm, I'm guessing it was hitting uh, a hitbox there of the tree. I don't know. This time, if I get a longer broadside shot, I might just take it. Instead of trying to get super close. I mean, it's still kind of fun, but it, it's, this will get kind of annoying. Me doing the same thing over and over again. So I think he's right there. Yeah, he's coming through. I mean, if he goes broadside here. Okay, so he sees us now. He's going to lay down. And there's no shot here, right? So he's kind of broadside. Well, let's give it a whirl. See what happens. Nice, there we go. Oh, stomach though, darn. Oh well, does it still let me have it? It's not yelling at me that I messed up, so. Oh, is he down? Right on nice. I can already smell the barbecue. Way to go! What are you waiting for? Go claim your trophy. Hogzilla's down. All right. Look at the tusks. Claim. Uh, only 300 points for him. Oh well. We get a lot of money for the mission. Yay! Pro hunt complete. You have finished a year hunt. 6,300. Cool. Everybody sees those big tusks, and that's what they care about. But their meat is great eating too. Back home, we call them Barbies, because they barbecue up so well. <laughs> oh, okay. A animals added. So it kicked me back out here. Alright, what else do we have to do? So we can do... What's this? So four times... Okay, so this is a uh, pen cushion. So... Pen cushion with a heart, lung, or spine shot. Well, I haven't tried any spine shots or anything yet. Uh, I'm not too sure. You know, I don't have time for another pro hunt. And this one's going to take a while. And this one requires a shotgun. So we're pretty much kind of set, right? Uh, we could just do an open hunt and see, or is there anything else to buy? We can try to see how the uh, deer call works. That could be fun. 5,000 to see. Uh, let's just see how this works. So deer call. And then it does give a bit of a description. Use correctly, deer grunt call can be a uh, a veritable monster buck magnet. Blow one grunt every few minutes. Push it too hard and you'll come home empty handed. 
White-tailed deer, black-tailed deer, mule deer. All right, because these are all white-tailed deer, right? So let's go down. Um, we're going to have to hunt this next time, so we'll keep the hunting pressure light. Uh, let's go back to Buck Hill, and we'll just do uh, a little bit more uh, bow hunting with the, with the uh, lure here. Just quickly here. So 7 in the morning. Uh, let's move the time up a little bit so it's brighter. And we'll just see what happens here. Alright. Let's just do an open up down a buck hill. Calls are a great tool in the hunter's bag of tricks. But it's also more an art than a science. It's always smart to call from cover. If he sees you, he'll spook. The best indication that you capture the animal's interest is to hear it call back. So immediately after calling, you should pause and listen closely. Okay, sounds cool. Let's just sneak up to these deer here. So this is good. It starts starts right by them here at a nine o'clock start. Okay, here they all are. Eleven point buck, two thirty-seven. There's a two two forty-seven. A smaller one. All right. Okay. So, do they see me? Why don't you give it a try? All right, but they're alert now. Shouldn't I wait till they're they're not alert? Let's give them a minute here. Wind's good. Okay, let's give it a try. L. Nope, didn't do anything. Oh. Wait for the animal to call back, or long enough that it seems real, and then wait a while to see if it's heading your way. If it is, hold the calling. The animal may get suspicious, but if you're to see it stopping and looking around, undecided, you may need to give him another nudge. Alright, cool. He's coming right in. Okay. Is he going to walk right on me? Hold there, buddy. Trying for a heart shot. Nice. Okay, he's going to be worth a lot. Can I hit the other lung? Yeah, good. Straight through the heart. This one will drop before figuring out what hit it. Nice. He's gonna be worth a lot of money. Full bonuses and everything. He's even a good score. Did the arrow go all the way through? There you go. Nice looking antlers there. Yeah, 2400 for that. That's that's how you make the money in this game. You do that triple double lung and heart. All right, let's go uh I seen which way oh, 70% hunting pressure. Uh ooh. Uh where are they? They're eating. I could turn around and go for this guy. All right, let's do that. We'll we'll let them go. And we'll just run over here. Oh, I think I'm supposed to uh, get some rabbits with the arrow. Oh, <laughs> I got him in the leg. Oh, no, I guess it didn't count. Usually the mission pops up. Must be something else. Oh, well. Oh, okay, so we got some deer. Looks like you can hear them about 150 yards out is when it starts. If that marker's in the right spot. And is there a nice stand I can sit in, maybe? Oh, there is. It's right here, though. I wonder if I can get in the stand and then call them over. Maybe try a spine shot or something. A spine lung shot, maybe? Oh, yeah, they're there. Oh. Oh, come on. I'm almost to the stand. Just a little closer. A little closer. 
Don't spook. There. Okay, good. So we're gonna wait till they calm down. Oh, look at that, a 278. Not that guy. A 280. Oh, these guys look awesome. Oh, these guys look cool. I mean, for an old game, it's still pretty awesome. Let's see what happens here. Now all their heads go up. Nice and immersive. He calls back. These guys are looking around. Okay. Changes in the wind direction can ruin your hunt if you're not paying attention and staying downwind from your quarry. Yeah, uh, but I want a different deer. I don't really want this one. He kind of walks funny. So what's he do? Does he just stay around here? What happens if I call again? Do I get another one to come in? No, it's just going to be this guy. Oh well. Can we do a spine shot? I don't know what happens here. <laughs> okay, spine in lung. Hit the spine. Excellent shooter. <laughs> Maybe both. Definitely excellent shooter. Okay, so they're off. I'm going to actually chase them that way. So they went pretty much uh, oh, west northwest. Okay, let's uh, grab him. He was the smallest one out of them all, actually. So what do we get for that? 300 points for the spine. The heart's 400. So 500, 1500, that's not bad. How much points you get for the brain? Gonna have to try a brain shot one of these times. Okay, so they went this way. Let's go get them. Okay, I think they're right here. Oh, I got multiples. They're kind of all over the place here. Uh, so I got the call. I can pretty much just call them in without really seeing them. That's gonna make it handy. Oh, there they are there. Okay, so they're on the move. Let's see how this works. So that stopped them because they were traveling. Yeah, these are the guys here. So this guy's coming in because he called back. Yeah, and he's, he's big. He's not the biggest one. Looks like the biggest one comes in last. There he is. 14 point. Both 14 point, but that one's bigger. Okay, so I gotta remember which way they're going. Alright, so he's trotting in here. It's kind of awkward kind of walk, but... Uh, so is he gonna stop, or...? I mean, it's still pretty cool looking deer for, uh, like, an old game. Oh! Hold. Okay, we're gonna try that heart shot again. Nope, nope. Maybe there? Oh, it's over the heart. Only one lung turn. Okay. Alright. So he's running off to the rest of them. That's okay, because we got one more, one more deer to take down in there. Right. Oh, that was quite the death call there. All right, so hopefully I can find them again, because they did go this way, and it looks like he was journeying in their direction. Okay, so here he is. Cool antler set on him. That's pretty. I, I, I mean, that's pretty good. Even though the fur looks okay. 
Okay, grab him. Not worth very much, but that's fine. And he vanishes. And then they went this way. And hopefully... Find them. Uh-oh. Might have lost them. They just kind of went this way. So this is a cool spot here. Set up here in our rifle. Rifle blind here. Is there no jump in this game? Am I stuck? There we go. Yep, and then overlook here. So I think I've lost them, unless they come up here to drink. Um, I, can I just jump down here? Maybe, maybe not. Because I think there's a drink zone right here, but they're not here. Oh, maybe they're coming in. That sounds like white tail to me. Okay, they hear me though, so we're going to give it a second. I mean, this would be a cool game, like, just to hang out in. Like, just to, like, arrive here before they do and just sit in that blind. And just watch them come in. I mean, that's, you know, relaxing enough. Simple enough. They're still stomping at me. But I think I'll take one more deer and then that'll be it there. Yeah, he's, that's not the same word. He's only got one side, really. Oh yeah, this is, this is like the same deer. They're twins. Uh, I might do a long shot. Long shot's kind of fun. With the, with the bow. 100 yards. I also wouldn't mind trying a brain shot. Maybe I'll call one in and try a brain shot. As long as, uh, you know, the brain's where I'm thinking it is. Like, as in way of the hunter brain location on deer. Yeah, let's get in here a little closer. Let's see if one calls back. I like how their heads go up pretty much immediately. Okay, so it's going to be this guy. Yeah, I know you're alerted. Okay, I'll lay down while this guy comes in. I just, I want to be right at the edge here. Oh, he's not coming in anymore. Okay. I'll wait till they calm down, I guess. We got wind of the okay. Animals. So. There they are. Playing in the water. So if I can call one in here and try a brain shot and see what points that has. Okay, you're coming this time? Alright. Alright, we'll see if we can do this. This could be really tricky. Especially the head bobbing around. Get him in nice and close. Pop up. Draw. Hold breath. That is not... Darn. Oh yeah? Watch this be a brain shot. <laughs> and... Oh. Okay, you don't have to lead as much as I thought. Try again. Alright, let's see what happens here. Oh. Oh, come on. 
Is there any way to get rid of the graph so you can see like where it's flying? Like how do you get rid of the enter to pause? Can you you can only skip it. See, I want to see the whole like how it's flying. And there's uh is there no way to get rid of that menu? Hmm. Oh well. That's pretty awesome though. Oh, now it's all... I don't know what's going on now. Okay, there it goes. Oh well, I'll have to attempt a brain shot another day because that's uh, pretty much what it's going to be. You're going to pop into the menu just for a second to see if I can get rid of that. Uh, the bullet cam chart. No, it doesn't look like there's a way. That's too bad. I think that'd be cool. I don't really need to see the chart. I'd rather see uh, like the full flight of it. Uh, anyways, I'll keep messing around with it. Uh, that'll be it for now, because we're good. Uh, we're past the 40 minute mark, but uh, that was fun. Archer's really cool in the game. Uh, thanks very much for watching, guys. Everybody take care. See you in the next one.